individual doesn't get to see how he hurt me. He doesn't get to see how his actions uh, affect me personally, me mentally, me emotionally. I don't have to give him that. Well, that is the sister of Kaylee Gonsalves, who was killed in the Moscow murders. Gonsalves says they didn't want to give the suspected killer any satisfaction. As the quest for justice begins, the family wants the victims' names to be remembered when people think of this tragedy. Kaylee Gonsalves, Madison Mojan, Ethan Chapin, and Zana Kernodal. The sister of Kaylee Gonsalves sat down with ABC News. She says Kaylee and Madison Mogan did everything right the night of their murders. Vanessa Perez has her message. Responsible, compassionate, and smart is how her sister wants the world to remember Kaylee. The family says the situation may seem larger than life, but they want people to know they are human. It was, you know, more than a friendship. It really was a, a sisterhood that wasn't ever broken by anything. Almost two months since her sister's murders. Gonzalez says the roommates in the house loved to have fun, but did it responsibly. The Gonzalez family says they were prepared for a somber moment when learning of Koberger's arrest. Instead, it was more of a celebration. Feeling of relief was nearly palpable. Like, it felt like you were taller. Like, it felt like you could breathe a little deeper. Um, and that was unexpected. Gonzalez says the hardest part so far was the little to no information from law enforcement. They're now thankful to the Moscow Police Department for catching the suspected killer. The rest thousands of miles away in Pennsylvania at his family's home. ABC News learned from a law enforcement source that federal investigators observed Koberger around 4 a.m. as he discarded garbage in his neighbor's trash bins just days before his arrest. The trash ended up being key in the case. Gonzalez says no explanation or motive from her sister's killer will ever be good enough. So for me, I think that we have four names that we can remember and we should remember. Um, and that's Kaylee Gonzalez, Maddie Mogan, Zana Kernodal, and Ethan Chapin. Um, and as far as I'm concerned, those are the only names we need to remember and we need to know when thinking and remembering this tragedy. As she tries to sit with the reality, her two sisters are physically gone. You're supposed to grow up together. That's your God-given best friend. We were supposed to do everything together. Gonzalez also says she feels comfort knowing Maddie and Kaylee were together when the tragedy happened. As for Koberger, she says she wants him to receive the death penalty. Reporting in the studio, Vanessa Perez, 4 News Now.